Alex and I are all set up here. It took us a while on the tree. We've <laughs> been dropping stuff out of the tree, trying to get all of our camera stuff set up. Loving the crossbow. This is the first time I've actually ever hunted with the crossbow, number one, and this is the first time Alexa's obviously hunted with the crossbow. This is her first hunt behind a weapon just in general, so we're really excited. Really hot today. We had a cool front. The past four or five days have been really, really nice, but today's the first hot day, so that's kind of a bummer, but still have high hopes. And uh, we're just happy to be sitting in a tree. It's so funny. The two there. Okay, okay, I got it. <laughs> Here you go. You watch me do this all the time. Yes, you are. You gotta look away. I can't do it if you're like that. But you can't laugh. Because then I'm gonna laugh. There you go. Grant and I have been in the stand for about 45 minutes. I'm glad you look at this. Grant and I have been in the stand for about 45 minutes. And I can't do it. about 45 minutes now and this is my first time being behind the weapon um, I'm a little nervous but we did go out to um, Keith's farm and shot some yesterday and that went pretty good I was pretty on target I think <laughs> um, so we'll just see how tonight goes my plan is to get at least a doe um, I hope for a buck but if a doe comes through here, I'll definitely try to shoot for it to have a little bit of practice. So, we'll just see how the night goes. Okay, that's all I got. That's perfect. Well, we have about 20 minutes left until dark and we've only seen one deer and it, it was just a spike and it wasn't very big so that's all we've seen tonight but we're gonna come back saturday morning so we'll see you then you ready yeah let's see it you already got bit this morning by a spider Right there. Yeah. It itches and it kinda is hot. That ain't good. What if I can't shoot the bow? <laughs> you got it. What if it falls off? <laughs>
this is day two and the morning has not really been in our favor. Um, there were deer blowing as soon as we got in the stand pretty much um, from smelling us and then we had a few duck come under us and um, the lid was on the scope so when I went to look at them, it was just black. But um, we're going to be here for a little bit longer. See if we see anything else. So we'll let you know. was covered and then the second time she just wasn't really at a good angle for a shot. Um, I think we're going to load up here and go. Grant's going to go look at a new place for us to maybe hunt later this weekend or early next week. Um, so we'll see how that goes. <laughs> but um, we'll just, we'll see you next time. <laughs> Well, as you guys can tell, it's kind of a cluster this morning. That was completely my fault. Uh, I should have taken the cap off the scope, but uh, you live and you learn, that's not gonna happen again. So <laughs> I'm actually on a farm right now that I haven't stepped foot on since early August. And uh, I'm excited just to kind of walk it and see if I see any sign. Um, I got some stands with me that I'm gonna hang and. I just want to give that other property that we've been hunting a break, so um, Lex and I are going to try to hunt this property, just see what it's all about. She's going to shoot a, a doe or a buck, and uh, I'm excited to start hunting this place. Alright, well I just got done hanging the stand. I'm just a few sticks high back here, but I found this little ridge, it's like an oak flat, and I found a scrape that's like 25 yards away. So. This looks like a pretty good area. Hopefully there's some bucks in here. And uh, Alexa can either get a shot at a buck or a doe. We're gonna take the lens cap off the scope this time. <laughs> good. Guess what we're gonna do with the cat. Huh? We're gonna open the cat. You ready to rock now? Today's day three. Oh, we're on a new farm today. So hopefully we'll have a little bit better luck than we've been having. Oh, the weather's cooler and it's raining a little bit. <laughs> I cannot do it. I literally was doing so good. I was doing so good. Alright, okay. Rude. Okay. Try to look at the camera a little bit more. Oh, wow. You got it. That's... Okay, well, alright, that's okay. You don't have to. Okay, I'll just... I'll, I'll try. Okay. Um, hopefully we'll have a little bit better luck than we've been having. It's cooler today and it's raining, so we're hoping that they get to moving early today and we get a good shot. Um, Grant came out and set, set us up here, so we will keep you posted. <laughs> That's all I got. Wait till you have a perfectly proper 
has a deer down or not yet <laughs> we uh i think we had a little bit of miscommunication I, well i don't think it was miscommunication i think i think what what happened was she found the deer in the scope and, mm -hmm. as, soon, and as soon as she found the deer we were planning on shooting the doe on the right which is the one i was on but now after looking back at the footage we think that she hit the deer on the left, but we're not completely sure about that either. <laughs> I, I think when I got in the scope, it was the one on the left. Yeah. Whichever one it, I was aimed at was eating. Its yeah. head was down, and I shot it in the shoulder. Yeah. So on the video, it's kind of hard to tell because the crossbow's in the way. But if you play it slow mo, you can barely see what looks to be like a hole in the side of the deer, so. <laughs> Maybe. We'll, uh, we'll see. We're gonna get down and try to go find that arrow. It was so loud. Yeah. We'll get down and we'll see what it looks like. <laughs> She's going towards one. <laughs> oh no. That's awesome. What are we gonna do? We're gonna drag her out. Did you you knew that? <laughs> <laughs> 
Why did you not just tell me? <laughs> you totally knew. First <laughs> What are you laughing at? How out of shape we are. This is terrible. Alright, well here we are. It's October 16th. And Alexa got her first deer down. I'm so proud of her. As you guys can tell, we had a little bit of confusion there. Um, <laughs> I was at, on a complete different deer than she shot and we were so confused because when we looked back at the footage, like we said, I could not see an arrow in flight at all. And uh, I thought the only thing that it could be is that she shot the deer on the left that was, the crossbow was blocking the view of the deer. So super proud of her. It's been so much fun uh, <laughs> hunting with her this past weekend. Uh, a lot of laughs and it's just been so fun. It's, it's cool taking someone out that, you know, doesn't have that much experience in outdoors. Um, just watching them learn and um, just really showing them the ropes is, is awesome. So I'm super proud of her. And uh, now we're gonna go for a buck. Yeah. Um, I guess the biggest thing I learned during this, well, I've learned a lot during it. Um, Cause like he said, I've been hunting before, but not in this sense, not behind the weapon. Um, so I guess the biggest thing that I learned was just taking my time and making sure that um, I have the confidence to take the shot. Just. I've never shot an animal before, so that was something that I've learned to get comfortable with. Um, so yeah, it's been fun, it's been good. Good job, I'm proud of you. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And 